What's up guys? It's bigger than a motherfucker Thursday and to get my day started I'm gonna have a little bit of breakfast, a little, a little snack before I hit the gym right now uh, in like an hour. So I made myself some egg whites, I got some waffles and a protein shake. So I'm gonna try on this real quick so I can get the fuel and the energy to you know, hit the gym, you know, go hard as fuck, get bigger than a motherfucker. So, and today I'm gonna work out with my boy Ramon, he's gonna take me through a... Uh, not sure yeah i know we're for sure gonna do chest there's gonna be a chest and shoulder or like a chest in the back or something and he's gonna take me through his workout he's uh he's uh he's been working out for like a year and a half but he's getting some like some nice size and a nice a good amount of strength and i just want i just want to try something different you know maybe the reason i haven't grown that much in size is because i've been doing the same routine that's why i decided that it should be included in the series because i want to see how it works out how i feel afterwards and stuff and then if it works and if I, if I like it i'll just stick to that thank you guys so much for coming to my video again and roll the intro Well, that's the end of my YouTube career. Too much caffeine and enough caffeine. <laughs> oh, for sure, bro. <laughs> like, I got me, I got me some monsters. Should work out with him more often. I'm here with my boy Ramon. He's gonna take me through a back. No, I'm gonna throw a chest and a shoulder workout in the You need to right here, you see this? You need shoulders. No. Where? How you wearing Nike with Adidas, bro? There's Adidas. In some countries, you get killed for that, you know? So my boy said we're gonna start off with flat bench press first. Our, our sensei, sensei Torres. He usually, he usually charges 500 for a, uh, for a session. He's only charging us 200 now. Breaking in, shaping up, then checking out on the prison bus. This is it, the apocalypse. Whoa, I'm waking up. I feel it in my bones enough to make my system blow. Or, uh, what did we just finish doing and what are we doing now? We're doing a uh, dumbbell arm clamp press. Try to focus on going heavy with about 10 to 12 reps for four sets of these. Nice. You, heard, you heard it here first. Yeah, stop looking ugly. Hey coach, hey, uh, tell my millions of subscribers what we're doing next. Alright, so I haven't done this in a while, so I decided to take these guys to a drop set. Drop set. It consists of five plates of 10 pounds each. And we're gonna hit, we're gonna go 8, 10, 12, no, we're gonna go 6, 8, 10, 12, 15 uh, on, each, on each dropping set. We're gonna, put the, we're gonna put each 10 down, one more down, and then last one finish it off with the 15 reps and basically burn out the chest. So All right. let's see how it goes for these guys. Alright, so we're doing the uh, decline press. We're gonna do about 
we're going about eight to twelve reps on this as well. And we're gonna have four sets, uh, focusing on going heavy again. Do that muscle because going for that lean bulk, that lean bulk slash cutting. So nice. <laughs> So to get, a, to get a really burn off the chest, you want to go for cable flies. So we're going to hit, what I like to do is go low on, low on the way here and get more reps in. So we're going to go about 12 or 15 here, four sets. <laughs> Next coach. All right, so for the last movement, we're gonna do uh, chest incline press on a machine. Doing again four sets, going uh, more heavy to burn out that chest and finish finish it off. Uh, I usually like to do this one because it burns out my chest a lot, and that's what you guys are looking for to just burn out that chest and make sure to get that squeeze and that tight right movement in. So it's gonna be the last chest movement, and then we we'll want to show those after that. All right. Get big already. Hit him with the knowledge, bro. First of all, let me get this empty street. Empty street. Not only this on roads. Second of all, we're hitting the we're hitting the standing Man. shoulder press. You're making them subscribe, bro. All right. You know what? Sorry, I didn't mean that. We're doing the standing shoulder press. Um, usually a good movement to start with shoulders. What I like to incorporate during my workouts. We're gonna hit about. We're gonna do again four sets here. Not going. We're going around average weight. Weight probably bump it up. We're doing 10, 10 pounds right now. Bump it up to like 25 and then hit around 8 to 12 reps. That's what we left to go for today, and it's gonna be our first shoulder workout. Nice. Alright, better get big. So now we're gonna go into shoulder press, dumbbell shoulder press. Uh, again, focusing on going heavy. We're gonna do four sets of that. I hit around. I'm aiming for eight to twelve reps again. Uh, as I go as I go heavier on the weight, gonna go less on reps. So we're gonna try to do twelve, then I'm gonna go to ten, and then do eight. And then for my last one, I'm gonna try and go for six. So try to just uh, like I said, build build up more strength and hopefully hopefully go up on the weight. Nice, nice. Check it out, check it out. So, preach, bro. First of all, uh, if you're watching this right now, subscribe to the channel and like this video for a thumbs up for the workout. Second of all, uh, we're gonna still, usually, I don't go, I don't really do, I sometimes go heavy on shoulders, but for this workout, we're gonna do a light shoulder workout, but we're gonna do a superset. So, first uh, workout's gonna be lateral raises. I'm hitting around 15 for that, total 15, depending on how I feel. And then front raises for about 10 to 12. Really focusing on bringing out the shoulders and wrapping them up. That's pretty much it. Thank you. Thank you. Finish it off. We're gonna do some cable crossovers. Courtesy of him. Courtesy of my boy here. So if I don't get any gains, it's gonna be this guy's fault.
Big shout out to this guy taking me through it. I'll let, I'll let you guys know how it was. Later, I'll see, how, I'll see the comparison between how I feel the next day and then the so yeah, big shout out to this guy. I'll put his link in the channel in the description. Hopefully you guys enjoy his content and enjoy the workout he put me through. And, and now let me just do a quick recap recap of the workout and the differences. Well, first of all, the, the difference was that I do chest for my chest and shoulder workouts. I uh, I uh, I guess it's a pattern. I take turns. I do a chest exercise in the back. No, a chest exercise and then a shoulder exercise. So it's chest, shoulder, chest, shoulder, chest, shoulder. And when my the workout that I did with Ramon, it was all chest got all the chest out of the way and then shoulders so that actually that made a difference because uh it basically kind of drained my energy for when i got to shoulders i couldn't um i couldn't shoulder press the same amount of weight that i usually do and another another difference was that his is more more uh higher rep style style of training so he he does lower he for all his workouts he does lower weights and more reps and i usually do higher weights and less reps and, but then I but then I superset or drop set and he just always sticks to less reps and I think that made a difference when I'm doing my workouts because I wasn't used to that so I kind of failed a lot quicker and yeah that's one of the main differences but it's a different style of training that I feel like I liked it and we'll, we'll see how it goes and maybe if uh, depending how I feel tomorrow or I might do those exercises again we took longer than usual but it's still it's worth it because we did a lot of exercises and then hopefully that helps me out in the long run well yeah thank you guys for watching uh you guys could like and subscribe comment and say hi to your mom for me thank you guys